Piers Morgan's Twitter account was under the control of a hacking group, reportedly called the Chuckling Squad, this morning. The hackers sent out countless tweets, including a claim that Andrew Tate, 36, had died in Dubai, but the influencer himself spoke out denying the claims. Twitter users were shocked when an array of tweets were sent from Piers' Twitter account this morning, posting a variety of mostly vulgar content. While some tweets simply held expletives like FK the Queen, others had an even more serious impact on the celebrities and famous faces they targeted. One shock tweet from the journalist's hacked account read, Breaking news, Andrew Tate has been found shot dead in Dubai. Some followers were deeply concerned, especially as no media reports could be found to verify the news. However, Andrew responded through his own Twitter page, simply writing, hard to kill. Fans hailed the influencer as untouchable and bulletproof while others explained that Piers' account had been hacked. Andrew was not the only victim of this morning's hack, as a flurry of slurs and offensive messages were sent out from Piers' account. Some of the other victims included Ed Sheeran, who was called a ginger affer, and Boris Johnson who was told to get a effing haircut you ugly bum. Shortly after Andrew confirmed he was still alive, the businessman posted an ominous message to his page. He wrote, you know something. What you know you can't explain, but you feel it. You've felt it your entire life. You know Terry's something wrong with the world, it's a splinter in your mind, driving you mad. Don't miss, it is this feeling that has brought you to me. It is uncertain if the mysterious post referred to Piers' hacked account, as Andrew later turned his attention to environmental activist Greta Thunberg. He wrote a message directly to her, along with a photo of himself putting petrol in a golden Bugatti. Andrew said, I have 33 cars. My Bugatti has a W16 8.0 liters quad turbo. My two Ferrari 812 Competizione have six. Five liters V12S. This is just the start. Please provide your email address so I can send a complete list of my car collection and their respective enormous emissions. Twitter has since regained control of Piers' account and the hacked tweets have been deleted. Some of Piers' own tweets and photos were removed as well when the hack came to an end, but they are slowly making a return to the platform. While the hackers still had control of Piers' account, some followers pleaded with them to search his direct messages and questioned if they could see any conversations with Meghan Markle. The group simply replied that there was nothing interesting in his conversations and did not reveal any personal messages, 